Tell me repent. Repent, sinner! Tell him cry out to God. Come on, keep talking to him. Holy God! Repent, sinner! So okay, we gave. So okay, the life of steel will be wanted. Bring sinner's death. Free gift to God. A free gift. Eternal life. life. Through Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Our Lord. Our Lord. Turn to his beloved Jesus. He can set you free of your sin. Liars, thieves, adulterers, homosexuals, effeminate, sodomites, idol worshippers, drunkards shall not inherit the kingdom of God. God is calling you to repent and turn to his only begotten son and have life. I love you to warn you the wrath of God abide on those who do not put their belief and trust in Jesus Christ. You will perish in your sin. Drunkards will not enter the kingdom of God. Undressed modest women we not entered the kingdom of God. Jesus said, unless a man or woman repents, they shall not inherit the kingdom of God. God is calling you to repent of your sins, or else you will perish. Christ, turn to Jesus and have life. I love you to warn you of the wrath of God. God hates those who shed innocent blood. What about the abortion rate in this country? We say it's okay to save the innocent puppy dog, but then we slaughter babies every day. With all the babies slaughtered, you make Hitler look like a Sunday school teacher. That's how many babies are slaughtered every day. And God is calling you to repent of that and turn to the Son Jesus and have life. Jesus said He is the way, He's the truth, and He's the life. No man comes to the Father except through Jesus Christ. And I'm here to warn you. I'm here to be your best friend, to warn you of danger. I'm here to warn you of hellfire, that you must repent of your sins, or else you will perish in your sin. It's time to wake up and turn to Jesus Christ. <laughs> God so loved the world, He gave His only begotten Son. Whoever shall believe in Him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Believe is action. Believing is repenting. Believing is surrendering. Or else you will perish in hellfire. Turn from your wicked ways. Turn from fornication. Turn from your porno. Turn from your pot smoking. Turn from dressing on bondage. Let your body parts be all exposed. And turn to Jesus Christ. I come here to love you. I come here to warn you. I come here because I care about you. What kind of friend would I be? What kind of friend would I be if I didn't open my mouth? My prayer is that you repent and you cry out to God. Ask God for His mercy and grace. My prayer is that you repent of your sins and you turn to Jesus Christ.
I don't want to see you perish in hell. I love you that I warn you of the wrath of God. Oh, I love you wicked sinners. I want to see you get saved by Jesus Christ. How many people are going to get drunk tonight, huh? Yeah! How many people yeah. have, okay. How many people have sex outside of marriage? Yeah! How many people are going to look at porno tonight they don't get lucky? Absolutely! Yeah! yeah. And that's what's going on. That excites you. But I'm excited about Jesus. I'm excited about God. You're not excited about God when you get high, when you get drunk, when you're not filled with the Spirit of God. You're, you're going to get filled with the spirit of alcohol. Yes. You need to get filled with the Holy Ghost. You need to repent and put your faith in Jesus Christ who died on the cross to set you free. Whoever shall call in the name of the Lord Jesus shall be saved. You can be saved. If you're a homosexual, God can make you straight. If you're adulterous, God can make you get back with your wife. God can make the undressed, modest woman put some clothes on. God can make you burn your porno and read your Bible. Repent. Call in the name of the Lord and shall be saved. Cry out to God. Stop playing games. Stop listening to Hollywood. It's not reality. But the word of God is real. Sharper than any two-edged sword. The word of God testifies of Jesus Christ. You need to read it. You need to stop mocking God. I love God. Don't you judge my love of God. You love God? How much you love God? What's that? You said you're gay? Are you telling me you're a homosexual? I'm here to warn you of the wrath of God. And I don't want you to perish in hell. I'm here to warn you of the wrath of God. The wrath to buy that those who do not believe, that do not put their faith in Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. If you don't put your faith in Jesus Christ, you will go to hell. I can't say hallelujah that. But through Jesus Christ, you can be forgiven. Through Jesus Christ, you can have life. Through Jesus Christ, you can have forgiveness. And have all your sins blotted out. Repent and believe. Have life through the King of Kings. The Alpha Omega, the beginning and end. I pray you get saved and God draws you.